One of the features and routers best known for is vectorizing. Vectorizing is the process of taking a bitmap, such as a logo, and converting it from a picture format into a vector that can be got on a machine. This is an example of a low-resolution logo that was sent to us by a customer. Although there are a not very good resolution, there are not very good lines here that for us to vectorize, we do have a good contrast between light and dark colors. So by selecting this image and going to the Vectorize button, we'll have a few options. And Enhanced Curves is one that gives us a good result on low resolution artwork. If we zoom in here, we can see that we've created some geometries based upon that original drawing or, or bitmap. And in Point Edit mode, we can see that it's actually a pretty clean uh, process here. We might want to do a, a few things, such as doing a little cleanup, and we do have the tools in route to do that. Uh, if we select on this object, we see that there are different colors, and that tells us that this particular object here is a hole inside of this bigger shape. So if we wanted to try and make a continuous trough through here, we could start off by just deleting this shape and going by the, to the Cut by Line tool. And here we're going to use that just to get rid of these little end sections. Now I can select and delete the end sections and use my Join Contours tool to reconnect them. I can then get back into the Point Edit tool and this will allow me to delete a particular point and then maybe drag it back down to be a nice smooth area and in some cases uh, if we want to we can convert this to a curve or if we have a, an arc we have some handles we can drag around so in addition to vectorizing we have some nice tools here for cleaning up some parts after they're done now sometimes you might get an original piece of artwork that has a lot of of scanning noise in it and uh, we have an example of such a, a piece here uh, in this scanned image and here we can see that we see a lot of the pixels that are created during the scanning process. Uh, the, the enhanced curves method of vectorizing would give us a good result here, but it would give us a fair amount of cleanup to do. If we use enhanced corners, we would be able to filter out some of the resulting uh, chatter and give us less amount of time it would take to, to clean this kind of a shape up. So uh, here we can see the result that uh, it gives us a nice smooth line off of something that was not very smooth to start with. And uh, we could just come here and delete that point, convert this to a line, and then drag it out. So uh, we, we could uh, still do a little bit of cleanup here to help make this a, a good shape. Uh, here we can use the sharp corner tool to just come here and easily sharpen these corners and go back to point edit mode to maybe clean these up and flatten these out a little bit. So you do have the tools in here to once you create a, a particular surface to go in here and, and clean them up or once the, the vectors are created to, to clean them up a little bit.